hey y'all welcome back to my youtube channel this is going to be part two of the video that i just posted about god telling me every single answer that i needed i let me tell y'all something before i start reading i just want to tell y'all that i already had read this yesterday i read this in my head and i asked god oh my jesus i just peep oh my jesus i'm peeping some stuff y'all like i'm really <laughs> oh my jesus i'm not about to cry i'm not about to cry sometimes i can get so emotional like i'm just i'm thinking about it because i asked god yesterday i read this I, I read this same exact chapter james and i didn't understand what i was reading because i was reading it inside of my head and i remember i asked god i said can you help me to understand this like can you tell me in any specific way what are you saying like what it, what did i just read can you help me to understand what i just read and i'm telling y'all i kid you not everything that i just read to y'all in that other video and what i'm finna read to y'all he's tell he's answering so many questions oh my jesus thank you so much thank you so much holy spirit like i'm just so thankful right now y'all because i literally i remember i asked him yesterday I asked him, I'm like, I don't know what I just read. Can you help me to understand in a dream in any way? Can you just help me to understand? And right now, as I'm reading to y'all, some of the stuff that he that I'm reading, I'm noticing that he low-key talking about me. And it ain't even low-key, baby. It's a high key. But yeah. <laughs> I am so freaking corny. I said it's a high key. Anyway, don't mind me. Don't don't mind my jokes. Anyway, I'm just funny like that. You feel me? <laughs> anyway. Get too cocky now. Anyway. Yeah, y'all. So let's just hop right into it. So I'm gonna left, I'm gonna leave off where I left the last time, which says this is why the scripture says God opposes the proud but shows favor to the humble. Submit yourself then to God, resist the devil, and he will flee from you. Come near come near to God. Wait, come near to God and he will come near to you. Wash your hands, you sinners. <laughs> That just sounds so mean, you sinners. Wash your hands. I'm not making a joke of what God is saying, y'all. I'm just playing a little jokey joke. That's it. Anyway, um, you know, I'm just playing that say it's nothing. I'm not no, I'm not trying to like, you know, mock God or nothing. I'm just, you know. Anyway. Okay. Anyway, as I was saying, um, you sinners and purif purify your hearts, you double minded. Grieve moan. And well, change your laughter to moaning and your your joy to gloom. Humble yourselves before the Lord, and He will lift you up. Brothers and sisters, do not slander what do not slander one another. Anyone who speaks against the be, I'm sorry, y'all, I'm I'm stuttering. Anyone who speaks against a brother or a sister, or who judges them, who judges them, speaks against the law of and judges it. When you judge the law, you are not keeping it, but sitting in judgment on it. There is only one lawbreaker, lawgiver, and the judge, and the one who is able to save and destroy. But you are, but you are, hold on, but who are you to judge your neighbor? Oh my Jesus, let me tell y'all something. And I literally prayed about this. I, I told God, I said, God, I be judging people. And I I, I told him, I'm, I'm just being honest, y'all. Like, don't pretend like y'all don't judge people. Please don't. But anyway, if you don't know what the word judge means, just go look it up. I, I literally prayed to God the other night and I said, God, please help me to stop being so judgmental to just look at somebody like, why you got this why you got this why you dress like this like sometimes i could just be so judgmental when i ask god i'm like please help me to stop being so judgmental because that's not good and i literally i literally told god i said god you the only person who can judge who the hell am, like who the hell am i i the, the what like that's what i literally told him and, like i didn't cuss or nothing but i was just saying like who am i to judge anybody like you know, who am I? And that's what I said in scripture. It's just crazy. That's why I said God is answering every single question. He helping me understand everything. But anyway, let me keep going. Okay, let me keep going. Okay. Um, okay, who are you to judge your neighbor? Now listen, you who say today or tomorrow, we will go to this or that city, spend a year there and carry on business, make some money, make money. Why? 
you do not even know that there will be a tomorrow. Hold on. Why you do not even know if there will even be a tomorrow? What's, what is your life? You are a mist that appears for a little while, then vanishes. Instead, you want to say, if it is the Lord's will, we will live and we will do this and that. Oh, my Jesus. He is talking directly to me. Oh, my Jesus. Let me keep reading. Let me keep reading because I'm getting excited. Um. Okay. Uh, okay. Where was I at? Uh, we live. Okay. And do this and that. As it is, you boost and your arrogant schemes. All such boosting is evil. If anyone then knows the God they ought to do, wait, they ought to do and doesn't do it. It is sin for them. Now listen, you rich people, weep and wail because of the misery that comes on you. Your wealth has rotted and moths have eaten your clothes and moths has eaten your clothes. Your gold and silver are corroded. Oh, okay. That's the word corroded. Their corroded corrosion will be testified against you and you and eat your flesh like fire. You have boarded wealth in the last days. Look, the wages you have failed to pay the workers who have mowed your fields are crying out against you. The cries of the har the harvest the harvesters. What is this? Harvesters have teached the ears of the Lord Almighty. You have lived on this earth luxury and self and diligence. I think that's the word indulgence. Wait, indulgence, indulgence. Is that the word? I think it's the word. You know what? We're just gonna keep reading. Anyway, um, indulgence. You have faded yourselves in the day of slaughter. You have condemned and murdered the innocent, the innocent one who was not opposing you. Be patient, then, brothers and sisters, until the Lord comes. See how farmers wait for the land to yield its valuable crop patiently waiting for the autumn and spring's rain you too be patient and stand firm okay stand firm anyway let me stop playing let me stop playing okay um stand firm because the lord's coming near the lord's coming is near don't grumble against one another brothers and sisters and you will be judged the judge is standing at your door Brothers and sisters, as an example of patience in the face of suffering, take the prophets who speak the name of the Lord. As you know, we count the we count at blessed those who have preserved. You have heard the jobs, perseverance. You have seen what the Lord's final brought finally brought about the lord is full of compassion and mercy above all my brothers and sisters do not swear so when i read this the first time y'all i thought he was telling me not to cuss that's what i think he meant but i'm, I'm gonna do some research about it just to make sure okay do not swear where was i at oh not by heaven or by earth or by any thing else all you need to say is simple yes or no otherwise you will be condemned is anyone among you in trouble? Let them pray. Oh my Jesus. Oh shoot. Don't cry now. Oh my Jesus. Because I've been telling y'all for the longest. Now when I first read this, I knew he was talking about me because my auntie and her son got COVID. I almost just cried y'all because he's literally talking to me. And he was talking to me the other day, which was yesterday, but I didn't understand what he was saying because I was reading it in my head. But now that I'm reading it out loud, I, I honestly like understand it now. Let me keep reading. I almost just, I almost got so emotional. Like, I'm, I swear I want to cry. But anyway, I'm not going to cry. <laughs> anyway, let's keep reading. He said, um, what he say? Is anyone, un is anyone happy? Let them sing songs of praise. Is anyone among you sick? And, the, and by the way, y'all, this is James. What chapter is this? This is James chapter 4 verse. What verse is that? Hold on. This, that is verse 14. So it's, it's James chapter 4, verse 14. It says, is anyone sick among you? Let them call the elders of the church and pray over them and anoint them with the oil of the name uh, in the name of the Lord. And the prayer offered in faith will make them make the person sick. Uh, 
Oh my Jesus, make the sick person well. And when I read that, y'all, I knew he was talking about my auntie and her son. Like, oh my Jesus, because they have COVID and they're sick. And I'm like, oh my Jesus, I know you're talking about them. And then that's when I actually like pray for them and stuff like that. But yeah, I've been praying for them, you know. But still, when I read this, this was confirmation. But anyway, let me keep going because I get off topic. Um, where was I at? Um, okay, where was I at? Okay. Make the sick person well. The Lord will raise them up. If they have sinned, they will be forgiven. Therefore, confess your sins to each other and pray for each other so that you may be healed. The prayer of a righteous a righteous person is powerful and effective. Elijah was a human being, and even, even we are... Even we are. He prayed earnestly that he would not rain. And it does not rain on the land for three and and half. Wait, hold on. And a half years. Again, he prayed to the heavens. The heavens gave rain and the earth produced its crops. My brothers and sisters, if one of you should wander from the truth and someone should bring the person back, remember this. Whoever turns a sin from the error of their way will save them from death and cover over a multitude of sins. Okay, period. Now that's the end of that. That's the end of James, y'all. So let me put my um my thing, my bookmark back in here. So I got I gotta read um Peter next. Okay. Okay, so now I can finally tell y'all what I've been wanting to tell y'all. Okay, so I like I said, y'all. I read the I read the James. I read that chapter yesterday, but I was sitting on my back porch and I was reading it. But I was reading it in my head, cause sometimes I tend to do that. Like I won't like read it out loud, like I was just doing. But I read it in my head, and I didn't understand nothing. He was like I didn't I didn't understand nothing I was reading because I was reading it in my head. And now that I just took the time to actually spend time with God on camera for my, you, you know, not just for y'all, but just because I, to be honest, the Holy Spirit sent the idea to my head. Like he literally was like, it, I don't know, something just went off in my head and was like, record yourself reading the Bible. Like, and I believe it was the Holy Spirit. So thank you, Holy Spirit, for giving me that idea. Cause I always ask him in every prayer. I always ask him, can he send me ideas on what to talk about? And, you know, on my channel and stuff like that. And yeah, y'all. And I just, all of a sudden he, he sent me that thought and I came on here and started recording myself. And cause first I made a video y'all, but I ended up deleting that video because i was like i ain't about to post that you know what i'm about to do this instead but anyways y'all as i was saying god answered a lot of questions that i had he helped me to understand all of the all of the um what is it all of the questions i had for him yesterday he helped me to understand it thank y'all so much and thank you holy spirit and um I really, this is the end of this video. I really hope that y'all have a blessed and beautiful day. And please don't let nobody steal y'all joy. And I will see y'all tomorrow. God's willing. God's willing. Okay, period. Um, and thank y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to turn on my post notifications so y'all see every time I post. And, <laughs> bro, I'm so goofy. It don't make no sense. But anyway, I'm just, you know, I'm just a funny, you know, you know, anyway, anyway, as I was saying, I'm just real funny. But anyway, <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, y'all, let me stop. Anyway, thank y'all for watching.